there was a universe. We'd just begun to discover that distant galaxies have stars in them. Let's tune the telescope in to galaxies being born. And oh my gosh, who ordered this? We're finding galaxies in the Dark Ages. A Nobel Prize winning physicist has issued a stark warning. James Webb Telescope's latest findings confirm what many have feared, but few dare to accept. It's not just our universe out there. Webb's data reveals signs of another universe overlapping with ours, shattering decades of scientific certainty. For years, the Big Bang was seen as the singular beginning, but now evidence points to cosmic fractures, phantom masses, and light coming from beyond our cosmic horizon. This is a paradigm shift, says Nobel laureate Dr. Laura Mersini Houghton. We are no longer alone in a single universe, but part of a vast multiverse, an unimaginable reality where multiple universes interact. These discoveries don't just change astrophysics, they challenge the very nature of reality and our place within it. Humanity stands at the edge of a cosmic revelation that demands we rethink everything. Humanity's eye on the cosmic dawn. The James Webb Space Telescope was designed with one bold goal, to see the universe's earliest light and peer deeper into time than ever before. Launched as the successor to Hubble, Webb uses advanced infrared technology to look through cosmic dust clouds, revealing galaxies that were hidden from previous telescopes. It's humanity's eye on the cosmic dawn, the moment when the first stars and galaxies burst into existence. What sets Webb apart is its ability to capture light from the universe's infancy, pushing the boundaries of observation far beyond what was thought possible. Scientists expected it to confirm existing cosmological models like the Big Bang timeline and early galaxy formation. But Webb's first glimpses shocked everyone. It found galaxies formed just 290 million years after the Big Bang, far earlier than models predicted. These early galaxies aren't small or faint. They're massive and surprisingly evolved. The universe seems to be maturing faster than we ever imagined, said astronomer Dr. Jane Rigby. This challenges the timeline of cosmic evolution and raises questions about how quickly matter clumped together after the Big Bang. Webb's early images brought awe and puzzlement. The galaxies seemed too developed for their age, forcing scientists to reconsider fundamental aspects of how the universe grew up. Instead of confirming old theories, Webb is rewriting the cosmic story right before our eyes. But Webb's discoveries didn't stop with just finding ancient galaxies. It revealed something even more puzzling. Galaxies that seem to break every rule we know about how stars and matter form. These cosmic paradoxes challenge the very physics we thought were settled. Cosmic paradoxes. Among Webb's astonishing finds are dozens of ultra-bright, massive galaxies that don't follow known rules. These galaxies appear to convert nearly 100% of their way into stars, a process thought impossible because star formation normally uses only a fraction of available gas. Even stranger, many of these galaxies lack the dust and gas we expect in young galaxies, which are essential ingredients for star birth. Their brightness and size defy current galaxy evolution models, leaving scientists scratching their heads. The sheer efficiency and speed of these galaxies' formation is something our models cannot explain, said cosmologist Dr. Priya Natarajan. Are these truly galaxies or could they be something else entirely? Remnants of previous universes or structures from dimensions beyond our own? These paradoxes force astrophysicists to rethink timelines and mechanisms of cosmic evolution. If our understanding of early galaxies is flawed, what else about the universe might we be missing? Webb's data is opening doors to possibilities that once seemed science fiction. The discoveries are more than just surprises. They're a challenge to the very laws of physics and the story of the cosmos. As Webb peers deeper, it also looks beyond what we once believed to be the limits of the observable universe. Light is arriving from regions we thought should be unreachable. Taking us beyond the edge of the universe itself, this strange phenomenon raises profound questions about what lies outside our cosmic horizon. Light from outside our universe. 
The Hubble sphere defines the observable universe, the boundary beyond which light can't reach us because space itself is expanding faster than light can travel. Yet Webb's instruments have detected light coming from regions moving away faster than light, seemingly breaking this cosmic speed limit. This paradox means we are seeing light from bones that should never have reached us. It suggests that Webb isn't just observing our universe, but glimpsing beyond its edge. What we're witnessing may be the first evidence of regions outside our universe, or even hints of other universes. This is like looking past the walls of our cosmic home and seeing something entirely new, said physicist Dr. Laura, Laura Marcini Houghton. But what exactly lies beyond the cosmic boundary remains unknown and deeply unsettling. Is this the sign of a multiverse? A landscape where many universes exist side by side? Or some unknown cosmic structure that bends light back toward us? Webb's observations force us to confront a reality far stranger than we imagined. Questioning the universe's beginning, Big Bang has long been the foundation of cosmology, a singular event marking the universe's birth. But James Webb's latest discoveries are shaking this belief. Instead of a clean, simple beginning, the data suggests the early universe may be far more complex, possibly overlapping with other cosmic timelines. Some Nobel laureates and top physicists now question whether the Big Bang was a unique event at all. Webb's findings they hint at cosmic fractures, regions where two or more universes might intersect or even bleed into each other. This challenges the very nature of space-time, forcing scientists to revisit long-held ideas. As cosmologist Dr. Sean Carroll explains, we're seeing clues that our universe could be part of a much larger, tangled multiverse, where boundaries between realities are not fixed, but fluid. This concept breaks the neat picture of a singular cosmic origin. These revelations carry enormous scientific and philosophical weight. If our universe is just one among many, what does that say about the nature of reality? Webb's data is pushing cosmology into uncharted territory, forcing us to rethink the beginning of everything we thought we knew. Beyond rewriting the start of the universe, Webb's instruments detected something even stranger, a faint rhythmic pulse echoing through cosmic background noise. This cosmic heartbeat hints at a deeper, hidden message in the fabric of space, a heartbeat beyond time. Amid Webb's flood of data, scientists uncovered a faint rhythmic oscillation in the cosmic background noise, a pulse unlike any known astrophysical signal. It doesn't match pulsars, gravitational waves, or variations in the cosmic microwave background. Instead, it's precise, mathematical, almost like a coded signature. The pulse is so regular it almost suggests deliberate encoding, says physicist Dr. Avi Loeb. Some speculate it could be a signal from exotic matter or a cosmic message from beyond our universe's boundaries. If true, this heartbeat could change how we understand dark energy, dark matter, and unknown forces shaping the cosmos. It suggests the universe might carry a hidden language or structure embedded in its very fabric. Whether natural or artificial, this discovery forces us to consider the possibility that the cosmos itself is communicating offering clues about its deepest nature, and perhaps even its origin. Adding to the mystery, Webb's observations reveal massive gravitational effects with no visible source. These phantom masses suggest something unseen pulling on space-time, perhaps shadows of another universe. Shadows of another universe? Webb's data shows gravitational influences far beyond what can be explained by visible matter or even dark matter. These phantom mass fields exert pressure on space-time, bending it in strange ways. The source remains invisible, as if coming from outside our universe. Some scientists now propose these anomalies are the fingerprints of a parallel universe interacting with ours. The idea of mirrored or entangled universes gaining traction in fringe cosmology offers a new way to explain these effects. The gravitational forces we're observing may be echoes from another cosmic realm, says theoretical physicist Dr. Laura Mercini Houghton. These phantom masses could reshape our understanding of cosmic structure and evolution. If true, this would mean our universe is just one piece in a vast interconnected multiverse, its fate linked with unseen neighbors across dimensions. This notion ties into an even stranger idea, that our universe might be a mirror image of another. 
with time flowing backward and reality reflected in ways we can barely imagine. Time reversed and reality reflected. Fringe cosmology revisits the idea of a mirror universe, one where time flows backward relative to ours. Webb's observations of particle behaviors and galaxy rotations hint at a symmetry, suggesting overlapping cosmic systems. This mirror universe could be entangled with ours, influencing physical laws and even the arrow of time. It's a radical shift that challenges our deepest assumptions about causality and reality. If true, this entanglement means the cosmos is more complex than a single timeline. It's a web of interacting realities, each influencing the other in subtle ways. Dr. Laura, Mercini Houghton reflects, this concept transforms how we think about physics and even the search for extraterrestrial life. Life as we know it might exist in realms where time flows differently, hidden just beyond our perception. Finally, Webb's most mysterious finding, a cosmic echo. Light appears to fade and then reappear, hinting at boundaries beyond our universe or reflections from unknown cosmic structures. Light bouncing beyond the universe's edge. Webb's instruments have detected light signatures that fade only to reappear later, a cosmic echo defying expectations. Two main theories try to explain this. One suggests light is circling a finite, closed universe, traveling vast distances before returning. The other proposes it's reflecting off a boundary or interface with another universe, some kind of cosmic mirror or barrier beyond our own. This discovery challenges our ideas about space and time, hinting that the universe's edge isn't a simple boundary, but a complex interface with something else. As physicist Dr. Jim Peebles says, these echoes could mean our universe is part of a far stranger multiverse, where light and information bounce between realities. Webb's findings open the door to a new cosmic era, one where humanity must confront a multiverse far stranger and more complex than ever imagined. The James Webb Telescope's groundbreaking observations have opened a door to a universe far stranger than previously imagined. Among the most startling is the detection of gravitational anomalies, phantom masses with no visible sources, that suggest the pull of another universe exerting influence on our own. This isn't science fiction, it's data prompting Nobel Prize winning physicists to rethink fundamental cosmology. The idea that multiple universes coexist, sometimes overlapping or even interacting, shakes the foundation of the Big Bang model and forces a radical reconsideration of space-time. Webb's data also reveals light arriving from beyond the observable universe's boundary, light that should never have reached us. This hints at realities beyond our cosmic horizon, suggesting we are witnessing the faint echoes of other universes. As Dr. Mercini Houghton warns, we are witnessing the fingerprints of another universe, and this will revolutionize physics. It's a cosmic wake-up call, urging humanity to accept that our reality is part of a far grander, more complex multiverse, one that holds secrets still beyond our grasp, but now undeniably within sight.